Black Slenters. It is technically Thursday, and you are watching me. Was that creepy enough for you, Linda? are coming along nicely. I'm loving them. Me and Kirsten are totally on the same wavelength. Just putting that out there. And uh, Linda, <clears throat> what are we in? Like the OK Corral or something? Ugh. Anyways. So this week is about sex, drugs, and rock and roll. <laughs> no, it's actually about um, drugs, alcohol, and other stuff. Let's start with alcohol because that's the easiest one. Uh, in my country, you have to be 21 or over to purchase or consume alcohol, which the purchasing, obviously, but the consuming. And here's the thing that gets me it's if when you turn 18, you can't enlist to serve the United States of America. So they hold you to that maturity level, but you're not mature enough to drink an alcoholic beverage. I'm not a huge alcohol fan. I do drink every once in a while. It's nice to just kind of be lucid and loose. You know, just to loosen up every once in a while. It's fun to be buzzed. I don't know, just, it, it, for me, it's a, uh, a filter killer. Like normally I would filter what I say to maybe spare somebody's feelings or to not make them think I'm stalking them, which my thoughts would definitely make it seem like I am, which I maybe in a little bit, but that's not the point. I started talking <laughs> a lot and I be I'm the kind of drunk that's like, I love you guys. <laughs> I love everybody. I get really goofy when I'm drunk. I'm okay with alcohol, it's like anything with modification with modification. With moderation, it's whatevs. Now, as far as drugs. Oh, cigarettes. That's what we were talking about, too. Bah. Here's my thoughts on cigarettes and kind of combining it with drugs. Personally, the reason why I don't like cigarettes and some drugs is strictly because you are consuming something that's being burned. That's like being in a house fire and just sucking it in. So that's my main problem with smoking cigarettes and like marijuana. Uh, as far as marijuana by itself, if you're not smoking it, like say in a brownie form, I'm a little bit more okay with it. Um, I've never actually tried it myself, but I hear it is interesting. I've smoked twice marijuana. The first time I got super tired and super hungry, which I'm already those things. So it just magnified it, which so great. So now I'm super hungry and I'm too lazy to get up and get food. Why? 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 There's no point. And the second time I did it, a friend of mine that was doing it with me may have sprinkled opium on it. Which, if you've never had opium, don't. It's such a pointless drug. Ugh. It was so stupid. I felt like a big sandbag. So I was tired, super tired, super hungry, and I couldn't move my body. Don't need it. So don't need it. And as far as drug use, that's all I'm from. As far as drug use, that is the extent of my knowledge. I'm gonna end this. And I'm gonna go back to doing nothing. Anyways, love you.